It's the kind of beat to go. Hey guys, what's up? It's Joey, and today we're here for some infected gameplay. Now, first off, I just have one question for you guys. What were your thoughts on the face cam? How did you like it? Did you enjoy it? Did you not like it at all? Give me your thoughts, because I'm thinking about bringing it back, because I really enjoyed it. Of course, I'm going to try to improve the quality as best as I can before I do that, but just kind of for future things. I just want to see what you guys think, kind of gauge the audience a little bit. But anyways, today we're here on my infected account, Joey, titled right up there, level 32, doing pretty solid. Not too shabby. Now, I'm kind of uh, chilling out around my levels, not doing too much with either of my accounts yet because I'm just kind of waiting for that next update, just kind of just chilling out until I get to that new content because I'm really excited for it. It's going to be tons and tons of new changes. It's going to be practically like a new game. So many awesome new things are being added, and I can't possibly wait any longer for it. I'm really hoping it's going to come out by the end of the week, but I can't tell you guys for sure when it's going to come out. I'm just not sure yet. But anyways, today we're going to be knocking out Boston Boston, Massachusetts, home of Proletariat Inc. Incorporated, where they're based. And as you can see, Fenway is looking good right there. But we're just going to try to power through as many levels as we possibly can and see how far we can get. See, try to get to Tier 1, but who knows? It'll probably take us a long time, but hey, we got some. I really love the graphics on this game. All those little thumbnails, they're just so cool. All right, so we got a pretty interesting loadout. We got a couple contractors, machine gunners, outlaws paramedics, all sorts of things. Now over here, this first spot, this is going to be cake. This is going to be a cakewalk for me. <laughs> Repeated the cake. Gotta love the cake. Anyways, these drones are going to be e easily, easily going to be able to take out these snipers, no problem. There's just going to be too many of them, and they're just going to be all wiped out pretty quickly. Now there's on the hospital. So that hospital is pretty much covered and done right now. So right here, we I'm just going to drop one drone here, and I'm just going to let this one, I'm just going to mutate it and turn it into the Harbinger and open up this little area for myself. And just start on our way. Alright. So I'm going to use all these assassins here. Because I like the assassins. And I want to see if they can help me. Okay, I definitely need to level these, level these guys up. They need to be leveled up ASAP. Alright. Blow that up. Reanimator. You can get me some more people. And let's just drop all the rest of the drones right here. Now those drones are easily able to take over the machine gunner. No problem. Finished off. Can completely wiping out all of the humans now we've got to take out the hospital now i'm just going to drop the harbinger so we can take out that hospital i'm going to stem up my guys right here stem them up take out those few remaining humans ah! love those guys they're funny i love them so funny all right cleared it and we are on our way to victory we are doing very good all right let's see how long is it going to take us to get there Let's do the math. All right, so four attacks at about 70. It's going to be about 28. So I think four attacks will get us there. So we're just going to attack until we can get to tier one. Unless my, unless any we have any problems, we may not get there. But we're going to try to get as far as we possibly can. So with this specific level, we're going to have an interesting little loadout here. I'm going to use all my assassins, and we're going to throw out these spitters. These spitters are going to try to take out these contractors as fast as possible, and hopefully we can take out that... Machine gunner back there with those spitters can get him out. There we go. Spitter nailed him. Perfect. Knocked him out. And it looks like everyone's going to bypass this one hospital because they're not able to see over that wall. So they're just going to bypass it completely. I think this small little horde right here will definitely be able to take out this little group of snipers and then move their way straight to that hospital. So I'm not too worried about them. So now we're going to have to start working on this area right here. So I'm actually going to drop a couple of drones and the harbinger. Bang. All right. Perfect. And we're just going to drop one more. Uh-oh, storage is almost full. I don't like that. All right. Maybe we're not going to be able to get as much gameplay as we want. All right, so I'm probably going to try to finish up this one level. and Maybe one more. We'll possibly squeeze it out. But right now, I'm just going to drop pretty much the last big groups of my drones right here. And we're going to try to finish them off and then work our way to that final hospital right there. Let's stim that up. Throw down some animators here. And let's get some more drones going. All right, perfect. Drone geyser, can I drop that right there? All right, we can get working on that hospital right there while everybody's kind of cramming behind that wall. They're not getting to that wall anytime soon. People are just crowding it up, and it's not doing anything. So we dropped a couple of drones right there. Bang, boom. Got to take out those last couple of humans, and we will be good to go. There we go. Perfect. I love it. That's teamwork right there. All right, one more attack just before the storage runs out. We got a Titan. I love it. Perfect. All right, one more quick speedy attack, and we will call it a day here. 
All right, attack. I'm bringing Aftershock. We need to make this as fast as possible. And goodbye, Mortician or Undertaker, whatchamacallit, whatever you are. We're going to bring the Titan. Why not? Let's accept. Let's power through Boston, guys. Grab a little water there. All right, so we're just going to let Aftershock tear through this area right here. Aftershock, you do your thing. Now we're going to drop a couple of guys right over here. We're going to work our way toward those Lumberjacks and the Outlaw. All right, uh, we're going to try to get as close as possible. I don't think, hopefully that Outlaw, ah, uh, barely missed it. Let's, start, let's drop these cesspools back here. Let's speed it up a little bit as well. Cesspools going to town. I love it. So is Aftershock. He's just about to drop everybody in his path. All right, so pretty much we're almost completing this level. Aftershock's going to wipe out that hospital quick and easy. Look at that. Boom. And that's it. The power of Aftershock is just too much too much to handle. We will be saying goodbye to Aftershock in the next update, sadly. He was awesome. But guys, thanks so much for watching. That's going to conclude this episode just because we're running a little low on storage. But thanks so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.